Says, farmers can help reduce the environmental impact of pepper cultivation, while also promoting public health and safety. Another solution to reduce environmental pollution in pepper cultivation is the use of precision agriculture technologies. Precision agriculture involves the use of data and technology to optimize farming practices, including the use of fertilizers, pesticides, and water. By using precision agriculture technologies such as soil sensors, drones, and GPS mapping, farmers can reduce the use of chemical inputs, promote soil health, and reduce environmental pollution. Another solution to reduce environmental pollution in pepper cultivation is the promotion of agroforestry practices. Agroforestry involves the integration of trees and shrubs into agricultural landscapes, which can help promote biodiversity, reduce soil erosion, and sequester carbon. By promoting agroforestry practices in pepper cultivation, farmers can help reduce the environmental impact of pepper cultivation, while also promoting ecosystem health and resilience. Furthermore, the promotion of sustainable supply chains and market incentives can also help reduce environmental pollution in pepper cultivation. By adopting sustainable sourcing policies and promoting market incentives for sustainable pepper cultivation practices. Companies and consumers can encourage farmers to adopt environmentally responsible practices, while also promoting sustainable and socially responsible supply chains. Finally, the promotion of education and outreach programs can help raise awareness of the environmental impacts of pepper cultivation and promote sustainable farming practices. By providing farmers with access to educational resources and training programs, governments, and GOES. And other stakeholders can help promote the adoption of environmentally responsible practices in the pepper cultivation industry. Another solution to reduce environmental pollution in pepper cultivation is the use of biological control agents. Biological control involves the use of natural enemies, such as predators and parasitoids, to control pests and diseases in crops. By using biological control agents such as ladybugs, lacewings, and parasitic wasps, farmers can reduce the use of chemical pesticides which can help reduce air and water pollution, while also promoting biodiversity and ecosystem health. Furthermore, the use of renewable energy sources can also help reduce environmental pollution and pepper cultivation. Renewable energy sources such as solar and wind power can be used to power irrigation systems, farm machinery, and other agricultural operations. By using renewable energy sources, farmers can reduce their reliance on fossil fuels, which can help reduce air pollution and greenhouse gas emissions. Another solution to reduce environmental pollution and pepper cultivation is the promotion of circular economy principles. Circular economy principles involve the reduction, reuse, and recycling of resources, which can help reduce waste and prevent pollution. By promoting circular economy principles in the pepper cultivation industry, farmers can reduce their environmental impact, while also promoting resource efficiency and sustainable development. In addition, the promotion of sustainable land use practices such as land restoration and reforestation can also help reduce environmental pollution in pepper cultivation. Land restoration involves the rehabilitation of degraded land through the use of sustainable land management practices, such as the use of cover crops and the promotion of soil health. Reforestation involves the planting of trees and shrubs on degraded land, which can help promote biodiversity, reduce soil erosion, and sequester carbon. Finally, 
the promotion of sustainable and socially responsible trade practices can also help reduce environmental pollution and pepper cultivation. By promoting fair trade practices and ensuring that farmers receive fair prices for their products, 